some hope. And there's somebody that seems to be tracking back. And the ball goes across the turf here. Yeah, maybe they're not struggling to do with it, but it's quite comfortable for him to get a hand on it. It's important with those uh, medium of fullbacks in the spaces that the, the morale they've got to cope with. Fullbacks who are leaving behind, as we saw there. Yours. And the Marco. Boydu. Modicero. Lampling unable to control. Asma near the gift of our way, but here comes John Vital. Richmond Lampling, good dummy. And two are trying to play the one to win Lampling, but they have to take over now. That is Boydu. Marshall in the midfield. For Kotoko alongside with the Siru, providing the shield for the centre back here in Timoru. Boydu goes for glory from this distance. It takes a wicked deflection of this centre Tinga in the corner. For Asante Kotoko. They know he can shoot. He's got brilliant goals from such ranges here. And once he gets the ball, nobody is actually close to him on here. And everybody is picking up the attackers. And so Boydu has got no pass on. He's landing the shots. Been blown down, they've got a corner to attack. There's five minutes in Takwa. Mediama Neo Kata Kaneole. There's a corner for the away side. Asante Kotoko. Is it more Ibrahim who lines up to deliver? Imoro delivers not good enough, but the clearance from Mediama. Just got to go back to session here is tomorrow. This time he does it better and that's the connection from someone watching but it goes out for a goal kick. Yeah, Imoro's initial contact with the ball from the corner kick was a disappointing one that he made a bench here there. He just was just very flat. The clearance as well was poor. But he made a mint with this one with delightful ball into the box and Sam Watson is is getting there, but he's under a bit of pressure so he can't quite guide it on target or low enough. Here is Mudasiru. Lamte. Good touch from the two gun now. Mono for Asante Kotoko. Look like a handball. Decision against Asante Kotoko. Free kick Madiama. to take the free kick, he swings one in. Adamak was falling so deeply back. No court kick from Baba Musa. Because he could get the advantage of his net take. Who watches ball? Good touch from Justice Mensa, but I feel comes in and reacts well. Now Lamte for Asante Kotoko. He's lost possession now. Here is Justice Mensa for Mediama. Wants to go with a drive on his left foot. Good idea, but execution yeah. not so good. Yeah. When he got the ball, he turned. Yeah, Lamte lost the ball. But once he turned, he realized they strike past now. Ansu was offside there. He ended up slipping through. And it, the only chance of him keeping the ball alive there was to. Go square to those who went off at himself. But he fancied his left foot, so he went for the driver. But to be fair to him, he couldn't have split the strike partner answer through because he was outside. Here is Baba Musa Abdelaito, the former Shaq striker, Justice Mensa shows great strength. Now Anso sees Darlington on the right, looking dangerous. Mediama, but Max Olajuman steps up and kicks the ball out for a corner. He wonder if Anso spotted a run off. Because he goes because Mr. Intelligent right there. If he slips in two, he's through on goal one on one. Got to cross back line, there's no resistance here. Nobody in the picture. If, if, if those who get through, he knows he's asking for that pass. They're going to be slipped through instead. He chose to go wide, and it 
the cross was blocked for a corner. Corner taken poorly. Lovely work from the winger now. Goes down, free kick. Asma, who's approaching from the right side of defense. This afternoon is caught by Lamte, but both players go down. Yeah, I think almost an um, entanglement between the two of them. And, yeah. Everybody's come off with some sort of pain in the end. And it was Asma's little pull and little skill to just spin around this man that was brilliant, wasn't it? And there, he's trying to kick the ball, Lamte is trying to clear the ball, let's kick it into Lamte. Can be a painful one. We're approaching 10 minutes between the top and the second. Kota Komediama. Komediama will have the advantage from this free kick. Yeah. And set pieces in this game will be crucial. Right. These two teams like to play the ball in the tough. They've got some very athletic players, so it means they can cancel each other well, but set pieces could be could be very crucial in this fixture. And Akwesi Donso is a specialist. He's caught just a goal in the season's league after 28 games. This is his 29th appearance for Mediama this term Donso. Scored in Mediama's home draw against Brooklyn Chelsea. And Donso sets up a Beidou into the side net as a goal kick. Yeah, disappointed because they've got some big frames in that box that I thought. And I'll swing that from those who could have been troubling. But if he swings out well, the lad can come come for it. Instead, they are trying to make something cute and effort it's into the near side. It's got to come the move! How did he miss this? Embella Etuga, but it's already been flagged offside. Yeah, but it's a blown that Etuga. He wouldn't have known that was offside, but that was an absolute pitch of a ball into the box. That was a brilliant cross into finding the two that yeah, he's offside, but he didn't know he was offside. Should be finishing that off. It came off the woodwork. It's mighty close, mighty, mighty close, but he wouldn't have counted. The two guys in search of his 20th Premier League goal on the move now. He finds Lamte. Lamte goes down with a strong challenge on him. Free kick. John Vital, a strong challenge on Lamte. Yeah, how sharp Lamte is. His fitness levels will be crucial for Kotoka today. But the game is going to be clear that I think that is why Ghana doesn't start really. The, the, the manager will be thinking who needs that need the, the athletic frame of Lamte. Immoral free kick, handed down by Baba Musa. Here is Mudasiru, up to the part of Immoral. Immoral and product is poor from the Kotoko left back. but he's able to get to Lamte into the sort of round of the two guard again flag of side yeah I think he is flag of side I think he was and you want to look at how Kotoko are shaped now he appears Kotoko are looking uh, like uh, look, look like they are playing a four four two of some sort the Lamte is not playing down the middle a lot more he's playing on that very far left side and I don't want to call the other side, it's, it's a cutting hand. The two that are going down the middle, and, and that could work for Kotoko because 
the, 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 the back three now will have two players to deal with. We'll have the incident that is giving Mediama a foul in a promising place where they can work one in. Mediama have a free kick. I think has gone in there. Wants to have a pop at it. Abdul Rabi Omar, it's been part of this Madiyama history. We'll get into that one later. You know, here is Donto who sends it across. And Madiyama doesn't make it count. Yeah, a much better execution than, than we saw the first time they tried to wear something cute on the far side. This time it's going with an outswinger here, taken away from the goalkeeper, but Baba Musa just can't keep the header down. With a series mix into the ball, but his advantage has something to cut a call. Jean Vital brought down by with a series free kick with the armor.